Hey there guys, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to use Loomly. I repeat, this is gonna be a full tutorial demo on how to use Loomly. I'm gonna give my personal opinion on if I think it's worth the money. And at the end of the video, I'm gonna give you an alternative that costs a little bit less that I think you might also have interest in. All right, so here is my guide on how to use Loomly. First of all, this is Loomly, the interface. I'm gonna just bypass all the signups just because it's you know it takes up three minutes. It's just the basic stuff where you sign up. This is the interface of Loomly. What you first usually do is it asks you to start a new calendar. I've already created one right here. And again, this gives you like a post overview of all of the posts you're maybe creating. Um, on the radar over here on the right is like, it's just maybe you have a scheduled post of something that's coming up. Um, quick links down here. Uh, there's some AI tools, but honestly, guys, this is a really easy tool to use. Um, but in comparison, my honest opinion, I think it's a little overcomplicated versus what some of the competition is doing. Um, and I'll talk about that at the end of this video. And again, this is my honest opinion on this. All right. So this is how you use Loomly. So first click on the calendar once you create it. And what you're going to have to do is it's going to ask you to uh, connect all of your socials. And Loomly does a couple of main features. I think it's like four features. So we have the scheduling of posts and we also have the interactions button here. And then also, which is like messaging and notifications that come in through your socials. And then we have analytics and reporting. And it's uh, Loomly is mainly just for like social posting, if that makes any sense. You know, like some of these tools are for other things, you know, like they have like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain this quite thoroughly, but Loomly is really stressed on like scheduling of posting, which like if, you, if you're looking for a tool for mainly that, this may be it. Uh, Loomly pricing is around $30 a month. And um, in comparison to like Hootsuite, I think is $130 a month. So it is like a third of the price. That being said, all you do is sign up, you get to this point, this is where you post. Uh, this is the calendar this is the next day here and all you do is click on add post see it right here click on that and then you can do a quick post a build post honestly um it's the build post is the way to go this is where you like um start creating the post in my personal opinion loomly uh over a lot of this stuff whereas like um you know i can show you one of its competitors here if i stop presenting this screen here um, I'm going to show you, a, I'm going to cross compare what it looks like on Hootsuite versus um, like, here's what Hootsuite looks like and which is a competitor, which is $130 a month. If you click on the planner, this is what the calendar looks like. And it's just, it's honestly like a lot easier to use. I can just click the time and post, click post, and I go right into the post and you can title it, choose the socials. Um, it's just a lot easier to use. Hello there. And then it, and then it makes it on the right and you can see the preview over here and then another one of its competitors is known as metricool and the same thing if i go to the planning tab here and i just click on a time it's going to do the same thing hello there and like i, I feel like loomly over complicates this a bit so that being said um is loomly worth the money in my honest opinion i don't think i would go with loomly just because you know it's a it's a great tool it's 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 fairly priced but i feel like for what you know i've done a cross comparison on all of these tools and loomly is not my favorite just because like the user interface is like really odd whereas like hootsuite and a lot of the other ones like uh later or uh, you know I've, I've done reviews on all of them so it's like uh, loomly is a great tool don't get me wrong but my honest choice would be metricool let me show you some features on metricool and again, it's only $20 a month. Let's cancel this. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, it's bothering me. And again, I'm just a normal dude giving my opinion here. Um, I handle a lot of businesses, social media management. So it's in my better interest to like have these tools like figured out which one is like the cheapest, which one works best for this feature. Metricool, this is it. It costs $20 a month. And this is the analytics and reporting. It's absolutely amazing. And you can export the reporting and you can show it, show the reports to your boss. Uh, the planning feature works amazing, just like I told you, and the inbox feature works as well. What's really cool here about the inbox feature is a lot of the, all of your socials that you connect over here on the left, let me go back here, like your Instagram, your Twitter, your Pinterest, TikTok, Google business profile. Once you connect these socials in here, 
it all goes to this inbox feature and like your YouTube messages will be sent here. Your Instagram messages will be sent here and it, see, you can see it right here. It takes a minute to comprise, but that's because it's grabbing it from all of your different socials. And this is huge. And what's cool is you can reply to the conversations in here. And then you can also use the phone app to, to like manage all those notifications there. So yes, Loomly is extremely easy to use. Um, this is again, how to, this is a tutorial on how to use Loomly. And it's really simple to use guys. Um, I, I know I did a demo on this. Literally, once you're logged in here, you have the calendar feature. You can click the post. You can have the interactions feature, which is kind of like the messaging I talked about. You can do comments, mentions. This actually works pretty well and the analytics and reporting. And what I noticed is it kind of gives you the reporting kind of like on a per post basis. And like I told you, Loomly is really like uh, on a post feature kind of basis, if that makes sense. So again, hit me up in the comments. Um, and again, if you're looking to get a free 30 day trial to Metricool, like I told you, which was my favorite choice here, uh, you can use my link down below. It is my affiliate link. You'll get a free 30 day sign up. It's $20 a month, but this is my choice on the social media management tool. So if you're looking, uh, you know, I kind of derailed this tutorial, but this is a cheaper option. And I've just literally gone through all the testing of Loomly. And I got to say, it's a little too complicated for me. And it's $10 more than the, the tool that I like a little bit more. So it is what it is. All right, guys, I'm going to quit rambling. Um, please hit the subscribe button. Hit me up in the comments too. Like I like hearing back from you guys. This is my tutorial on how to use Loomly. This is a demo. Do I feel it's worth it? It's pretty decent, but again, uh, the tool I would use is in the description and comments below. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.